All right, everyone. My name is Kevin, and I'm here with our FNM winner, Alex Knopf. How are you doing tonight, Alex? Not too bad. Not too bad. Awesome. So what'd you play tonight? Uh, Domain Zoo. I'm back in a proactive deck. I've been playing Elementals for weeks, and I'm like, this ain't it. This ain't it. I'm, I'm sick of going to time. I'm sick of grinding out. I'm sick of actually thinking. So we're going right for the face. We got... Um, Eight burn spells, bunch of big creatures. All we do is we hit them and we hope it sticks. Yeah, Tribal Flames goes upstairs. Exactly, every single time, baby. Awesome. So, tell me about your matchups tonight. Um, it was it was pretty straightforward. Played against uh, Yogmoff, kind of a non game game two. He mold to Oblivion, so it wasn't it wasn't much of a of a competition. And game one was actually pretty close. He had the Yogmoff out, but he was at low life, so Tribal Flames did him in. Um, I also played against Scam. Um, also, kind of a back and forth game. Mid range, you know, the usual. And then I play against Jund, another mid range deck. So I grinded it out and I just came out on top. I just drew better and my spells did more. So here's what it is. Yeah. So what are your thoughts on the modern meta right now? All right. So some, some people hate the meta. I used to hate the meta. I mean, I think the ring is pretty bad. I think it's kind of wild that Bowmasters is everywhere. You kind of have to choose your path playing one or the other or playing decks like Burn that are kind of in between. But in reality, it's not the worst meta we've ever had. And anybody who's played Modern for a long time knows that the meta used to be a lot worse. It's, I'll give it a C, C minus. Yeah. That's it's, what I'll give it. It's not Hogak. It's not Hogak, um, but it's obviously not the stagnation that we used to have after Hogak. It's, it's a meta that needs some fixing. It needs some shaking up, but it's not the worst. It's not the best. Yeah. It's just okay. Yeah, awesome. So uh, what do you think could get unbanned right now that you think would change the, change the format? Oh, thank God you guys asked me that. Okay, um, get ready for this. So Splinter Twin needs to come back like yesterday. Um, I want to see it in the meta. I want to see what's going to happen with it. I think it would shake up the meta in such a way that um, a lot of decks that are dominating right now would have to play around it, which would sort of unwarp the format in a way. Um, I think Birthing Pot could come back. I think it's a... Pretty good card. I think Yagmoth would definitely be a, a top contender for that card. Um, honestly, Jitte, I don't know why it's still banned. You know, maybe Hammer Time gets gets an upgrade. Um, all right, here's the controversial one. I want Loris back. You want Loris? <laughs> I want Loris back. I, I'm still waiting for them to explain to me why Loris is banned and the ring isn't. Where um, the matter right now is like. I want to say something like 40% of the meta is running either Bowmasters or the Ring, and Luris wasn't even up there when he got banned. He got banned because of overrepresentation, and by their own um, admission, he should be unbanned if um, if these cards are not banned. So that's my take on that. All right. Well, I appreciate your take. Thanks for sitting down with me, and uh, look forward to seeing you take down our other events. You're you're killing it, man. I'm trying, man. I'm trying. All right. You see you. Yep.